another vlogmas vlog today i am tack cleaning and answering your assumptions this is a really highly requested video i put a poll up on my instagram asking you guys for assumptions and i got lots <laughs> uh, but we're gonna do them now whilst i clean my tack i'm just using the prestige um saddle balsam for my saddle but yeah let's get into the video Okay, so I've also like crossed everyone's names out because I didn't know whether people would want it included or not. So I just like wiped everyone's names out so no one gets like offended or anything. My saddle's actually pretty clean, so I'm just literally gonna put the balm on it. It doesn't need like actually cleaning. Okay, so number one, you are an only child. I am not. I have a younger brother. Um, he is three years younger than me. You don't work and have help from parents. Um, no, <laughs> I feel like people don't think I'm as old as I am. I think people think I'm a lot younger than I am because everyone seems to think that my parents pay for everything. My parents don't really pay for a penny. Um, I work full time, I work seven days a week. I haven't taken a day off work in about three years. Um, every day I do some form of work. Um, so I pay for absolutely everything. My parents would never pay for stuff just like that. Um, Obviously, like, if I got really stuck and, like, needed, like, help or something, I'm sure they wouldn't leave me stuck. But, yeah, I pay for everything. My parents don't pay for anything for Chalky, anything in my life. I pay for it all, and I enjoy doing that. It's rewarding, I think. Never ridden on the beach. We used to be really lucky that um, when I was back at home, we lived by the beach, so we'd actually take the horses to the beach nearly every weekend which was so good. Um, we'd school on the beach, it was really good for their legs. I used to ride bareback on the beach. I actually did like my first bareback gallop down the beach as well, which was scary, but so fun. So yeah, I'm very fortunate that I used to actually ride on the beach more than I rode anywhere else. Uh, you dropped out of school. I did not drop out of school. I went to school, I had my GCSEs, I then got my A-levels, and then I went to university, and I actually have a degree in French and politics. So yeah, I, I actually studied in France for a year as well. So I really enjoyed like university. I think it's a really good experience. Although I think it was good for the social side and like growing up and like developing as a person. I think it's overpriced for the education that you get and especially the availability of jobs that are there after university. You only jump the views. I think if you watch my stuff you know I don't only jump for views because my jumping content isn't actually that entertaining because I don't jump very big. <laughs> uh, we're very much still getting to grips with our jumping so. You're a nervous rider. Um, I wouldn't say nervous, I'd say I'm a very cautious rider. I don't um, take unnecessary risks and like I'm careful and I think actually I've become more cautious the older I get because like obviously I have to pay my own bills, I am self-employed. If I get hurt, it will affect like a lot of my life. Like I have bills to pay and stuff. So um, I'd say I'm a cautious rider. You rushed into buying Chalky. Definitely not. Um, I was waiting for a few years to buy my own horse. So I had a lot of time to think what realistically I wanted and needed. Um, and I've like, had horses before so I know what I like and what I don't like so in that respect I had a list of must-haves and things that I absolutely would not compromise on um, so that really helped me narrow down when I was choosing horses to go view I had a few viewings booked um, but after speaking to the person the sales agent working with Chucky's old owners um, we really thought that we would be a good match, so she squeezed me in and wanted me to view him first. And it turned out for the best because he was exactly what I wanted. I did not have to compromise on anything and like his colouring for me, because Dunn's are my favourite, um, that was just like the cherry on top, but I absolutely did not rush. If you know me, you know I'm like the most sensible, responsible person when it comes to decision making. I don't rush into anything. Come and join me. Okay guys, we've actually turned this into a muck band now because I'm gonna get on the wrong track. Alice and Chloe have come with the goods. 
Yeah. So the tack Mara, cleaning. Oh, here I am. Wait, where's Wally? Uh, wait, Wally, come on. Wally, come, come. I'm just going to be in right The oh, tack cleaning has been safe. abandoned, and we're now doing a mukbang. Um. Okay, so Alice is going to read the assumptions to me whilst we eat our food. You have a tack shop addiction. I wouldn't say I have an addiction. I just happen to be filming every time I'm in the tax shop, so it looks like I go and spend more than I do. And I also stockpile everything I need for when I go. So it looks like I have an addiction, but I'm actually just very strategic in when I go to the tax shop. You bought Chockey for the YouTube... Okay, I'm really... <gasps> I really have got dyslexia. <laughs> you can do this, you've got this. Uh, <clears throat> you bought Chockey for YouTube purposes. That's really mean. Um, no, I feel like that's a lot of money to spend on something just for YouTube. Um, I actually made YouTube videos when I was like 10 with my old pony. They have all been removed from YouTube because they're incredibly embarrassing. Um, but no, I did not buy Chucky for YouTube. I bought Chucky and then decided to document the journey. How long have you owned Chucky? Um, like a year and a half now, I think. I bought him in July last year. So yeah, like a year and a half. You get scared when he's fresh. <laughs> I definitely used to. I'm getting, the more confident I'm getting on him, and the more I know him, the less it intimidates me. But it definitely used to scare me. But I think it's like what we were saying before, you don't know how far they're going to take it. Whereas when you know what they're going to do, it's less scary because it's not the unknown. You are secretly buying a second horse. Who exposed me? <laughs> okay, secrets. Okay, secrets. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm not secretly buying a second horse. I would like a second horse one day, but right now I want to put all my attention on Chucky. So. You want the best for your horse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I hope everyone would assume that I do want the best for my horse. You seem like the type of person who avoids drama at the barn and avoids it. Oh, I think the rest of that was avoids it well. Oh. Um, avoids it well. I think so. I don't... I might watch it from my stable, but I don't get involved in it. <laughs> I try not to get involved in it. <laughs> you but, work very... Oh, but well. saying that, we don't really have much drama on this yard. No. Like, for a yard, I feel like we like there isn't really any drama here. We all get on so well, and we all really support each other as well. Yeah, we so, do. I think we're very lucky here. Oh, oh my god. Oh, that looks the so dog good. keeps taking my chips out my hand. Keep them. No, I'm not feeding them. <laughs> I get distracted and then he eats them. You work very hard for your money to spend on chocolate. Yeah, I work literally seven days a week. Um, you are a really brave and friendly person. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to say no. <laughs> I like to think I am. I don't know about brave. I say I'm friendly. I try to be friendly. <laughs> no! I'm only joking. Obviously, you're very friendly. Hey, or we won't be sitting here. Chloe's really quiet back there eating her burger. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to chat? You've got to get involved. You're part of the vlog now. Yeah. Chloe, how brave was I when I jumped off Chucky when he reared that time? So brave. <laughs> yeah. Were you there? No, I missed it. <laughs> I was so brave. <laughs> she was like 15 foot in the air. So. <laughs> Could have done me your parachute then. Yeah, I really. I would have oh spooked God. everyone though. Yeah. If, my, if my air vest went off that day, <laughs> oh, we yeah. all would have died. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm like. When you have your air vest on, riding mm. with you, it's going to be a little scary. When uh, we were on a hack, I, didn't, I don't think I put it right. on. Because I was like, if I came off, with Bruce there, I'd be scared for you. <laughs> I'd be a goner. You'd be gone. We I would never be see you again. Off ski. Actually, do you know what? I might, if I get stuck at the puddle and we let it off, I stand behind you. <laughs> I'd be myself. straight through the puddle. Straight through. <laughs> Jockey is actually quite lazy. Um. No, I wouldn't say he's lazy. He'd be quite hot and sharp. Um. But then again, Ash Road. No, who it? Jess got on him like last year and he wouldn't even trot but I think it's like if you ask him properly he'll do it and if not he'll walk around and then like violently spook at something so he likes to keep you on your toes a bit. I feel like you would buy a foul. I don't know why. Wait are you saying that was that assumption? <laughs> <laughs> That's what he says. I thought you were telling me that. No I, I, I'm going to try to do the crying emoji as well. I 
feel like you would buy a phone. I don't know why. Mm, not anytime soon because I'm in my prime of like horses in my life. Like I have the time for them. So I don't really, I don't want to wait four years to even start something at the moment. Chucky is easy to ride. Uh, I wouldn't say he's difficult, yeah, but, but you have to ride him. Like he won't just go into a contact. You have to ask properly and stuff. So, and also I wouldn't put like a novice on him just because of how sharp and fresh he can be. So I think he might be a bit too much for you. <laughs> I did get a bit nervous. <laughs> Chocky? Full Connie? Question mark? Full, full Connie? Full Connemara? Yeah. Chocky is... <laughs> no, Chocky's an Arab cross Welsh. Mm. We have a few that aren't assumptions. Wally's coming but... to get involved in the vlog. Oh, Wally! Oh, no. Wait, Wally, stand up so you can, they can see you. Do your scary walk. There we go. Good boy! Oh, yeah, look, he's <laughs> Yeah, do, do, if it's not an assumption, just read it. Oh, why don't you like the vibrant saddle pads? <laughs> She's a colour snob. <laughs> <laughs> it's as simple as I'm a snob. <laughs> <laughs> I just really, if I had a different coloured horse, I'd have colours, but I think with a dun, it's so difficult to make colours look nice, so. Yeah, I just... You do always, like, whenever we get like a new colour, you're mm. always like, oh, it looks so nice, it looks so yeah. nice. Yeah, and when I was actually looking for horses to buy, I really wanted like a dark bay, like kind of rain's colour, because I was like, oh, I'm thinking of so many like, ways I could style that colour with other colours, but then I ended up with a done. So I think the only thing that really looks good on them is neutral colours, so. But I support... you're not getting there. I'm getting there. I've, I've bought an oak set, guys. Yeah. What more do you want from me, that honestly? That is really <laughs> You spend a lot on Choggy. Mm. More than I probably should. Yeah, I spend as much as probably most horse owners do, but also I think I save a bit because I literally come to the yard twice a day, so, like, he's on like proper DIY livery, so I do save money. But now I spend it all on petrol coming here, so. Chucky is secretly a unicorn. Correct. <laughs> I mean it every 10 Who's minutes. Who's that down there? <laughs> oh no, she's coming forth. Oh, Chloe's Whoa. getting involved. It's because she's privileged. Oh. It's because she's finished her mad now, so oh. she can concentrate. Chucky is a forever horse. I hope so. That's my intention, but obviously you don't already know. Life comes at you quick. If he doesn't go in that trailer next time, <laughs> he will. <laughs> but my intention is for me to have him forever. I mean, there might be a situation where I might loan him out if he's never not suitable for me. Chloe shook that kid. Ooh. But I am a control freak, so. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> I would be the worst person to loan a horse from because <laughs> you will never make me happy. So. <laughs> Chucky has become a hotter horse than you were expecting when he was a baby. Oh my god, when he was four, turning five, he was so quiet. Remember when I first got him and hacked yeah. him out? And he was so chill. He, he was so chill and he has got And we couldn't believe how young he was. Yeah, everyone was just like so shocked. But he's become a bit more of a maniac as he's getting older. Slightly. <laughs> <laughs> becoming slightly unhinged. Um, but I actually quite like um. it. <laughs> I was just going to say, honestly, mate. <laughs> but the more confident I'm getting, I'm enjoying that he's got more, like, character, so I don't mind it. Chucky isn't going to jump big enough. Big enough? Yeah, she just says jump big. She oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, I've done it again. <laughs> That's Alice's assumption, just coping <laughs> someone else. <laughs> <laughs> um, he's only going to do 50 times. <laughs> Cross poles only. I think he'll jump big enough for what I want because I'm not like a super brave rider, especially jumping. So I, I don't want to go do a one meter fifty tracks. You know, like probably one ten is the biggest I'd ever go up to, and he's definitely capable of that. So one meter fifty. Yeah, obviously I'm not doing that. Oh, I know. <laughs> I feel like I'll be chimed out and then jump back in for one meter fifty. I had to just say I'm going to go to the Olympia next week. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually booked into the Grand Prix. <laughs> <laughs> And she's jumping on Lottie. <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> that needs to be block of us. If, if this video gets 100,000 views, Chloe will jump Lottie. When did I agree to that? <laughs> no, that, that is, yeah. That is a deal. Can we make it so. like 100 views? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe 50,000. 50,000 views, and you'll see a video like no other. It's it, spectacular. It will be the best experience of your life to watch this. Shoot. You're not involved in the vlog. It'll be the okay. most chaotic thing you've <laughs> ever seen. We will have an ambulance on standby. Oh, you're the best rider ever. Chucky is gorgeous. 
it's confirmed. There we go. I have nothing to say. Someone has just confirmed it. I don't need to say it myself. Correct. It's it's there in black and white. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> Is that what colour you want? I, I bought it last night. <gasps> Not that one. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to see what I did? I don't know why that right. made me laugh so much. <laughs> no, look at them! I did the speed drive on that Equidry colour. <laughs> no! Stop! <laughs> why is it just a blur? <laughs> I don't go get it in a white shape! <laughs> what did you get in the air? <laughs> <laughs> I can't be decided. You look like a Victorian man. <laughs> Deciding what colour to put on chocolate. Sorry, but that's the colour of my coat. I just like face tune it onto my body, so they, this is me trying on oh. Equi Dry colours. No, love. No, she reckons that is grey. <laughs> no, the it's the same colour as my coat, and my coat is green. Don't slide, slide across. It looks like the Victorian menu. You might need to zoom out. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> no, the pink one. The pink one. That one. <laughs> And you guys are telling me I look like a victim. <laughs> 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 oh, there was some more. Why well, if I get a comment about you should not be feeding dogs McDonald's? <laughs> <laughs> Wallace thinks otherwise. You regret buying a trailer. No, I love my trailer. And it's really handy and convenient. And a good stepping stone, I think. So, yeah. You make six figures on YouTube. That is £100,000. So definitely not. Um, I make, I do make money off YouTube, but it's obviously not my full time job. Um, but I make enough it for Chocky. It's basically like Chocky's Chocky's job. It's Chocky's job. Chucky. It's Chocky's income, and it covers him basically. So yeah. Chocky earning his wage. Chocky earns his keep. Yeah. But yeah, I think that is all the assumptions for today, guys. Thank you for sending one in if you did. Thank you for watching. But yeah, thank you for watching another Vlogmas vlog and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!